I am going to take this information. I am going to take this information back I with me. I have a question. Yes. All you have to do is stay a minute. Just take your time. The clock is ticking. So stay. All you have to do is stay. Yo. That's all you got to do. I am back. Welcome back to the Lockout Man podcast show. The show where it just keeps the goodness coming. What's going on? I am Lockout Man. Thank you for being here. If you like content like this, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and hit that bell and that all button for more. And that all button so that you know when I pop on, that's what's up. That's what's up. Welcome to MTC. Yes, sir. This time, uh, this time is brought to you by the subscribers. The subscribers just come, fills in, and say, yo, Lockout Man, I need you to call this person. I need you to call that person. I, I need to get information because, you know, I, I, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to ask. I don't know what it is. But I am here. That's what's up. I am here for you guys. I am here. We here. This is what I do. In this episode, yo, but before I get into all that, look, look, look. This takes a lot of time. You know, I got to go and research the company. I got to call the company. I got to have a conversation with the company and 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 do this video and edit the video for you guys. So why don't you do me a favor and hook a brother up with some coffee? You know what I'm saying? The cash app and the coffee app is in the description. It is dollar sign lockout men and hook your brother up with 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 support man because youtube don't pay me for doing this i'm just saying i'm just saying the youtube don't pay me for doing this and i like doing it for you guys and it's cheap because you guys could pretty much give me a cup of coffee for a couple of dollars i'm just saying just saying okay but welcome welcome so in today's episode we have a conversation with let me see. Who did we talk to today? We talked to CLE Transportation out of Norwalk, Ohio. That's right, Ohio. That's where I'm from. I did not realize that there is so many good companies out of Ohio, man. Out of Ohio. I talked to the young lady. Uh, I, I talked to the young lady, but before we get into the conversation, why don't I just go down and tell you what this company is about cle transportation they got three divisions they got otr they got uh short regional and they got long regional uh short regional consists of 500 mile radius around ohio and long regional is pretty much anywhere from minnesota anywhere be any anywhere anywhere in that map right there you see that that map right there. That's that's where they that's where they out. And yes, they do go up into New York City. Yes, they do go up in Maine. Yes, they do go up in the uh, top part of the Northeast, places where I am not happy at. In the conversation that I had with the young lady, she said they only do New York City six times a year. But um, but Painesville, or not Painesville, Pennsylvania, Maine, all those little crevices up there. Yeah, they do go up there. All right. So let me uh let me break it down for you. Let let me tell you how how they talk. You know what I'm saying? The young lady I talked to, fire. Fire. I want you guys to give me leave a comment in the comment below on uh on uh on what you think of this, on what you think of the conversation, man. Fire, straight fire, straight honesty, out the gate. She no bullshit with this company. You know, you she feels that if she comes with the bullshit, you're not going to like it. So whether I she she came to you with the straightness and that gives you when you get there, you either say, yes, I like it or you don't. This company figures the old premises sitting around, not making no money, constant breakdowns, tiresome dispatchers, over promising and under delivering tired the same old core of companies 
with large driver turnovers. This company is different. It's a smaller company. You know what I'm saying? It's been in business for 20 years. 20 years. And that's what you guys like. She already said that, yo, we got people that came, that came over here that says, yo, I wish I would have came here first. They require two years of experience, two years of experience. So just make sure that you have that. They don't do out of school. So sorry, New Jacks. You know what I'm saying? You got you to gotta get your two years of experience in with U.S. Express first and then hop on over there. Um, you can take the trucks home. That's a plus. Uh, and drivers, I, I'll let her tell her a telling in the in the um, in the uh, conversation. But the requirement is, uh, you need two years of consecutive driving, no more than two moving violations on your MVR. That's Motor Vehicle Report. So if you don't have no violations on that. You're golden. No more than three places of employment in the past five years. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can't be a job jumper because that's not what they're looking for. They're not looking for job jumpers. They figure if you coming in there for the job jumping, that's what it is. They got a. They got. They don't have what is called a sign-on bonus. They have what is called a transition bonus, and it's not high. I'm just saying. Clean CSA. Good employment record with no major issues on the DAC. They look at that closely. Clean background check. No felonies. But even though I did mention the felony, I think it's on a case by case basis. Uh, drivers are expected to utilize their clock to the hour and move their 10 day or night. They want you driving. They want you to make money. Uh, conversation, uh, conversation. Now, it says here 51 cent, but she was honest. That's up to 51 cent, but you're not guaranteed 51 cent. You're guaranteed to make money, though. Uh, cash advances of $150, Isorio pay for unloading and driver's assist, 95% no-touch freight, layover pay is $100, breakdown pay is $100, detention pay is $15 per hour after the two hours and quarterly increments. 401k bonus with 2.5 company match after a year. Sign-on bonus, which is the transition, transition bonus, is a thousand paid vacation after 90 days total of two paid vacations after one year paid holidays local drivers only though uh if you're over the road you will be averaging about 2800 miles per week weekly home time averages of 48 hours at home per week or i'm sorry 43 43 hours per week at home 24 hour dispatch so that somebody is there when you need them they have home care or they have health care the equipments are mats and western star trucks additional benefits they do have a pet policy and they do have a rider policy so what do you think? This uh, this company right here. What do you think, man? What do you what do you, what do you think? Have you heard what you like? Do you like it? Do you like it? Do you like it? Do you like it? If so, let me know in the comments below. All right, let me know in the comments below. We are about to get talking. Hello, is this Mister Sean Anonymous? Yes. <laughs> yes, it is, Mr. Sean Anonymous. <laughs> How you doing today? Well, hello, Mr. Anonymous. I am doing good. How are you? I am fine. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, right now, I'm just, you know, just doing my homework, uh, you know, filling out uh, companies that I come across uh, on the Internet and stuff like that. Um, 
I came across well, how'd you. How'd you come across us? I came across you guys. Well, actually, I came across you guys two way. I, one way I was in a Facebook group and we was talking about uh, local companies because I am from Ohio, Cleveland to be specific. Um, we was uh, that was one way, and then another way is that you know you popped up on my you popped up on my feed in my uh, in my uh, Facebook so. Facebook group and yeah, Facebook I pop up feed. On everybody's feed. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm on everybody's feed, yeah. You say you on everybody's <laughs> feed. God damn it, man. Okay now. I am. Okay now. Not okay. conceited, just convinced. Okay now. Let's, <laughs> let's back it up. Let's back it up. <laughs> um, okay. Uh <laughs> I, like I said, if you don't mind, I, I you know, I, I don't want to waste your time or anything like that. So basically, I just like to call and ask questions if that's if that's quite OK. I'm not going to take too much of your time. Oh, yeah, absolutely. All right. Um, no, you're fine. Uh, of course, being that uh, you guys are from Norwalk, Ohio. Right. So how far is that from Cleveland, actually? So uh, Norwalk is actually a warehouse, and it's our offices. Mm -hmm. Huron is actually where the terminal is located. Okay, yeah, so I know. Uh, yeah, I know where you're Probably forty-five minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Down. Uh, what is that? Seventy. Huron? No. 90. Uh, route two. Yeah, route two. Okay, okay. Two. Um. From ninety to two. Exactly. Okay. So yeah, I'm familiar. I'm familiar with that. So let me ask you. Let me ask you this right quick. So. Uh, are we first are we being that I stay in Cleveland and not that far, can we still take the trust home? Are we allowed to take the trust home on our home time? Well, that depends on what position you get. Um, well, right now we don't have any local positions open in that area. We're actually looking more towards Dayton and Columbus. Okay. Um, the position I do have open right now is a uh, over the road position and a we have a short term regional and a long term regional position. Now I'm looking at I'm I'm on your website and I'm looking at the map as far as regional goes. Now what do you, now you cover everywhere from Minnesota all the way up until Maine, right? Are you on our website looking at the map? Yes, ma'am. Regional driver area. Okay. Yeah. So it yep. looks so that would be a map of the long regional. So when oh. we say long regional, we mean uh, anywhere from in a circumference of a thousand miles. Okay. And then the short regional is anywhere in the circumference of 500 miles. Oh, okay, okay. Um, so, yeah, basically you'll be like a, a runner when the, in the 500 miles. You'll do some deliveries, but you'll be doing some trailer switches too. Oh, okay. Will I still be averaging about, uh, what would you say here? Would I still be averaging about two, uh, 2,800 miles a week though? So regionals are salary positions because Ooh, you're not okay. going to get as many miles, so your checks are not going to be as good. So we developed a salary position. Okay. Uh, the short regional is twelve hundred dollars salary a week, and the long regional is fourteen hundred a week. Oh, okay, okay, sounding good so far. Now the short regional, I'm I'm good with that because I don't like going up in the Maine or New York, but. If I do decide to take the the long regional or come in and go with the long regional, uh, will I have to go up in the spots like Jersey, New York, New York City? I mean, those are those are you know states, not cities. So I, I mean, can't guarantee you know what I mean. Never you, go to them state. You know what I mean. Yeah, <laughs> I'm you, sorry. you'll be up there once in a while. We do New York City about six times a year. Oh, okay. um, and that's amongst, you know, all the regional drivers plus the over-the-road drivers. So, you know, it's like pulling straws. You could do it. You could not do it. Oh, okay. Um, so And that's another reason why we have the salary positions for these jobs because if you do happen to go up in that, that direction, you know, you're, 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 you're going to get paid. Not, your drive time is not the same. Right. And you're going to get paid for it. Okay. 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 So, uh, so, th th and that's offered now, let me ask now that's offered to anybody with no matter how much experience they got. Am I correct? Like I got five years. We require two years. Oh, you're fine. We yeah. require two years of service or two years of experience. Okay. Now we'll do the, now we'll do the over the road. Here's oh, go ahead. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, no, go ahead. No, I was about to say, what, what do, do the over the road pay? Yeah, because it says here when I'm looking at your conversation at home time, it says fifty one. Is that is is that? 
that's an up to. That's an up to rate. Okay. Um, so we could honesty. Uh, I like we that. Could to fifty one cents per mile. Yeah, I, we're very honest. We're a smaller company. Um, we don't cover you with bullshit. We're going to tell you straight how it is. If you don't like it, that's on you. Okay. Um, that's just how we do things here. Okay. I like that. So, so. over the road position, <laughs> you could start at 51 cents per mile. However, um, it's very rare that that happens. The reason being because is we don't want job jumpers because it costs money to orientate and train exactly. you guys exactly. um, to get you out on the road. We're paying for hotel. We're paying for, you know, food. Um, Mm Because you get a $50 gift card, you get $200 paid orientation costs, um, and then there's the sign-on bonus. So we're not looking to hire somebody. We're not in desperate need. So I take my time. We're not looking to hire somebody that's going to be a job jumper. We want really good um, backgrounds, like your MVRs and your CSAs. What they about, have to be perfect to get that fifty-one cents per mile. Now what? Now what am I going? Now what are we going to actually come in as? What what would we what would we be what what would we be coming in as? That depends on after I do your application. So okay. you would fill out an application, and then I would run your MVR and your PSP, um, and that tells me your CSA scores, mm-hmm. um, and then it also tells me any accident ticket history in your in your uh, vehicle. Even personal vehicles count in the trucking industry because if you're reckless in your personal vehicle, what are you going to be inside of a truck? Reckless. And these are not cheap trucks. You know, we just bought new trucks. So it's very important to us that we get somebody that's a good fit, um, somebody that's going to get along with everybody in the company because we're very easy to get along with. Mm -hmm. If you can deal with my attitude, then you can deal with them. (laughs) Oh, okay. That's what's up. That's, That's what's up. Uh, yeah. You, you mentioned uh, now. You guys now it's per diem. Is that is that mandatory or is that optional? Well, no, no, no. So we're we're working on the website right now to get the per diem part taken off mm-hmm. because um, if we were to do it, it would be mandatory if one person chose it. So we're trying to get it off. Okay. Um, we do the cents per mile. There's bonuses every quarter. Um, they they go above and beyond, you know, to try and even work out bonuses at the end of the year. Those are not guaranteed. If we have a good year, then yay, we get one. Okay, okay. Uh, sign on bonus. How much and how is it paid? It's okay. So we actually call that a transition bonus. We put it on sign on bonus because that's what you guys know it as. Right, right. Uh, it's a thousand dollars and it's paid in two. So your first check is five hundred plus the two hundred orientation. And then your second check is the other half of that sign-on bonus because your mile pay doesn't start until your third week. If okay. you start driving your first week, then that mile goes on your second week's check. Mm-hmm. And then um, your third week is nothing but miles. Okay. Um, to, uh, Orientation is about two days. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. Oh, I, I wasn't going to say nothing. I'm listening. I'm, I'm listening. What? Wide eyed, wide eyed, uh, and bushy tail over here. About two days. <laughs> you first day you're going to get drug tested, and then you're going to do a road test, mm-hmm. and then you will put up with uh, some boring concepts um, coming out of my mouth, and then the second day is videos and more boring concepts. I like you. This is the most honest. <laughs> I, man, I am, I am, I am enjoying myself right now. You, you can't believe how much I am enjoying this. Well, conversation. if I'm not honest with you, then it's going to. If I'm not honest with you, then you're going to come over here and you're going to be upset because I lied to you. If I'm honest with you, then you're going to tell me yes, you like it, or no, you don't, and you're going to either go your way or jump aboard. Exactly. Either way, no feelings to hurt. Correct. Exactly. Exactly. I like. I, I like that, and I like honesty, man. Somebody. Some. We. We need more of you. Can. Can we get a clone of you at every company that I talk to, man? Man, I, I tell you, you. That would be awesome. Except for, I think the most of the people you talk to are actual recruiters, and we're not. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's like, up. Uh, there's no recruiters here. I'm in this building working just like everybody else. Uh, as far as, uh, as far, as far as the big difference, exactly. So as far as bringing people in, does, let me ask you this, does people like, you know, in the Facebook group, we was talking about like how, how felons would come in and, and, you know, come in, but 
What about guys with with no diplomas, no high school diplomas, or no GEDs? Will you guys still be able to bring them in, why or does that, that matter? Why affect you driving? Okay, okay. Yeah, why would that affect you driving? Okay, okay. I don't think that, um, yeah, because, I mean, if you're in high school and you don't finish, you still get your driver's license, correct? Correct. You don't need a GED or a high school diploma to drive a truck. Okay, okay. And that doesn't mean anything anyway. I know plenty of people that run their own businesses with no high school diploma or GED. Exactly. What about now, I I just mentioned felons, so what's, what's, your, what's your take on felons? Um, so it depends on how old and what the charge was. Okay. Because we do deliver to marine bases as well. Oh, okay. So you have to have a trick. Wait, do you have to have a trick card with that? Um, no, you can oh. just, it's just that they require a background check at the gate. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah. I'm clean. So, I'm good yeah. to go. <laughs> so it just depends. It, okay. But if you knew somebody that you were bringing in, yeah, it would just depend on what it is, how old it was. And then we would make sure not to send them to those places. Okay. Okay. Um, all right. Well, a few other questions. And Did, then there is also. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, let me do mine first. Oh, go There's ahead. Go also ahead. a um, bonus. There's a bonus. So if you were to come aboard mm-hmm. and then bring somebody to jail to board and they stay six months, then there is a um, $2,000 bonus. Okay. Okay. That's what's up. Leave, leave like it up. Like a referral bonus. Leave, yeah. l- leave it up to me to bring people on because I can do that. <laughs> I can do that. Uh, especially if I, if, especially if I like the company, I, I, I can do that just as easy. Um, what about the equipment? Now I, I'm, I'm, I'm back on the website again and I'm seeing, uh, man, I'm, I'm seeing these Max, uh, Western stars. The Western stars. Yes. Yes. So are are they manuals or are they automatics or what what are they? Bought to Max. Oh, okay. I, I I just lost you, you for me? a whole yeah, I can hear you now. Uh what you was about to say? Okay. So we everything that's on that website, those are all taken. Mm-hmm. Um we had to go buy some trucks. So we bought two Macs. Um so we have a black Mac and um two white Macs available. They're okay. all automatic. And then the regional trucks we just bought as well, they're used. They're 2018, 2019. Those are smaller trucks because you guys aren't living in them for three to four weeks at a time. Okay. So um, they don't have a frick in them. They have the bed. It's kind of directly behind the seat. You know, I'm being honest. They're, they're not Mac Anthem. Mm-hmm. Um, so they are a lot smaller. But oh. regional, you know, you guys just aren't in them the same. So for the for um, we for, do try to when we mm-hmm. go ahead. No, no, no. You go ahead. Go get, ladies first. Oh, okay. When <laughs> when the boss buys trucks, um, he does have to. He likes to have them done to his specifications because he's also a driver. Um, so he likes them comfortable. He likes you guys to have the room and the refrigerator and a place to put a microwave. They come with uh, APUs, inverters, um, those kinds of things. Things that, that you guys, the over-the-road trucks, those come with. Okay. Things you guys need. Okay. What about a what 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 about what about a driver camera? Is is that inside or outside or both? No. Nope. Okay. No. So um, the insurance company is trying to talk us into it as far as facing the road. Mm-hmm. Um, we have not made a decision on that, but as far as facing you guys, we're not on board with it. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. That's your guys' bedroom. I mean, I don't want a camera in my room. Is that, you so honest. Damn it. I love you. <laughs> Man. <laughs> um, C, uh, uh, C, C, R, C, 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 L, E. How long have, how long has the company been in existence? Since you said something about the boss. So we've actually been around for 20 years. Um, DS Express was the first part of it. That's been around for 20 years. And the CLE transportation side, um, that has been around for the last 10 years. All right. And the reason why is because DS Express got so much bigger. So we had to branch off and put all the drivers on one side of it. And then we also have the brokering company on the, on the DS Express side. Okay. 
So three positions that's available, the short-term regional, long-term regional, and uh, OTR, which sounds all great. Over you, the road. Over the road. You guys do, uh, you guys do uh, all, all 48 states for the over the road part, right? Yes. Yes, sir. All right. All right. Well, I am going to take this information. I am going to take this information back I with me. I have a question. Yes. I have a question. Yes. What is your last name? My, uh, see, I don't, I don't want to give out my last name. You owe me. <laughs> I've been honest. I've been honest. All right. All right. My name's. Le okay. And, and I do, uh, I do have a, I do run a, I do run a Facebook group for drivers. Um, I also, I have a, I have oh. a Facebook, I have a Facebook group for drivers. I have a, a, a Instagram page for drivers and I have a, and I have a YouTube page for drivers. So all the information that I gathered, you know, I, I do like it for myself because this man, I, look, if I ever decide to leave, well, when I decide to leave, I will definitely have. Now I got a tanker company. I got a tanker company that I that I recently talked to too that I really like because I have tankers on my uh as for my endorsements and I really want to use them. Oh, who was it? Uh T it's called T Who was it? T T R D out of out of Jersey. Out of New Jersey. Now I was okay, so I was I, don't know this. I was telling the young lady at the time. I said, "Yo, I I I said I don't like uh I don't like the Northeast, but she said that being that I do tanker, you know I I don't have to worry about you know all those little cuts and crevices and stuff like that while I'm driving tanker with their with that company. But but uh but so far, so let me ask you something. Yes, ma'am. You're what what do you, what are you really? What I I'm a driver. I'm I'm a five year driver. I I've, I've been <laughs> I've been out here driving. Trust me. I, so then, why are you calling around for information? Well, I do. I I not only do it for myself. Because you're not really looking. No, I don't. I I not only do it for my. <laughs> I not only do it for myself, but I also do it for. You know, I I I I do it for my. I do it for my driver friends. You know, the new guys that's coming in. That's uh. That's, that's, so you will refer me to people? Yes, most definitely. Most definitely. <laughs> that, that, that's no doubt about that. I'm not here to like I like I said in the beginning. I'm not here to I'm not I'm like you. I'm not for the BS. I I I'd rather spot I'd rather spot like your company in a good light. And especially if they know that I like it, right. then of course you're gonna be like, Man, I'm getting the insurgence of calls and where this is coming from. And you can you can count me for that. <laughs> but um but uh but yeah, man. I mean, but yeah, I uh I, I I wish I I wish somebody was doing have done this for me when I was coming out because you know, I, I wouldn't have made the choice that I made five years ago. But it's still my, you know, it, it's still my experience. I'm, I'm, I'm thankful. I'm thankful and glad for my experience that I got from all of that. But now that I got it, I want to pass it right. on. I want to pass it on to the, to the next person. And I guess that's, I guess the that's why group. I do it. Right. Uh, you know, I get it. I get a lot of people that come in and they're like, oh man, if I would have started here, this would have been the end of it. You know, mm -hmm. I wouldn't have been through everything that I've been through in this driving industry mm -hmm. so i understand exactly. hey you want to take down another number so when you talk to them you can give it to them i will hold on i as a matter of fact if you like you can you can email me all the information and i will put it all in i, I will put it in the description i will put it in the i will put it in the uh facebook group and all that good stuff so you ready for the you, you want to email it to me send me all of that and i would definitely definitely put it uh, put the you know the contact information and all that good stuff where they can where they can call you and you know sit down and uh, talk with you and come on and like I said if every okay, okay. I and plus I got plus I got you on I got you on the list now because like I said um, 
like I said, the company, the company I'm with, you know, okay for the most part, but I, I do, you know, being that I do live out of Cleveland and you said that we're able to take the, you know, we're able to take the trucks home, then yeah, that's, I, that's a consideration yeah. that I, I'm very much interested in. So, but thank you. Thank yeah, you for I your time. Yeah, and I let you know when a local position, you're welcome. Um, I was just going to say I could let you know when a local position opens up too. What part of Cleveland are you in? Uh, Right over there on the east side, right over there near Route 2. <laughs> That's why I said I was familiar when you said Route 2. So <laughs> I used to be. Uh, I so used... you're over by the Elyria or. Uh, that, like um, towards more. To field? Well, that's 90. More towards that, more towards downtown area, but that, like I said, that's why I'm I'm familiar how to get out oh, the okay. route too. So like Euclid. Yes, yes, ma'am. Okay, okay, right. so perfect. So, All right, well, it was great talking to you. Thank oh, you. it was so awesome talking to you. Thank you, thank you very much. You're welcome. All right, You're you welcome. take it easy. So we're back. We're back. We're done with the call. What do you guys think of that call, man? What do you, I mean, th th wasn't she straight fire? Wasn't she straight fire in that conversation, man? You cannot tell me. You cannot tell me that she was straight fire. Man, I'm telling you, she was straight fire. So if you guys like that, Yo, she sent me the information so that I can give it to you guys. If you're interested in CLE transportation out of Norwalk, Ohio, definitely give this young lady a call because she will not bullshit you. I got all of the, I got all her information in the description below. And, and yo, let me know what you think, man. Let, let me know what you think. Um, tomorrow, let me know man. what you think, man. I mean, we, we we about to get out of here. We about to we're done. We're done with another episode. T, I mean, we're done with another MTC episode, man. Yo, I mean, if you guys like it, yo, give them a call. Holler at the young lady. She will not bullshit you. This is the second company that I call and I enjoy both conversations. Yo, <laughs> I'm telling you, if you guys have any any questions. Yo, leave it in the comments below. Who you want me to call next? I'm back at that. Leave it in the comments below, man. Hook your brother up with some coffee because doing these calls does take a lot of, out of me and YouTube is not paying. I'm just saying, I'm doing this for you guys. Help a brother out, you know what I'm saying? Four years strong. Four years strong. MTC, y'all, MTC. Yo, I want to say, I want to say, if you like content like this, which I know you do because you keep asking me to do it. So I know you guys like it. You guys love it. You guys rocking with it. So hit a brother up. Yo, give me some coffee. If you like this, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and hit that bell and that all button for more. If you want me to call anybody, leave it in the description. I mean, leave it in the comments. Leave it in the email. Lockoutmanpodcast at gmail.com. Yo, on that note, I am done. Until the next call, until somebody else say, hey, Lockout Man, give this company a call. I will call them for you. You guys take it easy, and you guys have a blessed one. And I'll come back at you with another video. Peace.